coach. Hit me on the day. Man, just a lot more fun, you know, to have pads on and play real football. Saw some popping, saw some people really getting after each other. Uh, it'll be great to get in here and watch the tape. You know, I think our backs really flashed today. You know, from uh, Drake Clark's been a great addition, and we knew he would be, right? Starkful, played for Chris Jones and those guys. And, and uh, just just a really good player. Kenyon Clay, you can see the development in him. Uh, you know, Frank is Frank. And then I tell you, man, Chandler Pittman and Rambo are really coming on and have picked up the offense too. Chandler Pittman looks like his old self again, a year removed from that knee injury. He's bigger and stronger. He's been in there with Ann Carr. And, and uh, so I, I thought our backs flashed. I uh, thought we got some good pass rush today. You can see our D-line uh, doing some good things. And, uh, you know, we just got to keep going, man. That's three down. We've got another great day of install coming up on Thursday, and it uh, should be fun. Your starting tackles are set. Can you kind of talk about what's going on behind them and how important this is to, for that development of that depth? Yeah, I think set's a strong word, Glenn. But, but, but you know, Kyron Barnes got a chance to be special. He's at right tackle. Bryson Mays is at left tackle. Really smart kid that really knows what to do. We're working on him continuing to get more physical and add to his game. But they finished the year playing at a high level, and they've gotten even better this spring. Now what you're looking at, you know, is we've got uh, James Middleton at right tackle. He's really starting to learn the system to provide some depth. Really high on Gabe Cavazos from Lake Cormorant, played for Nick Nestor uh, out of Mississippi State, transferred to Mississippi State. I think he brings a lot of physicality and size and want to at that position. Peyton McKinnon's a guy that redshirted again last year out of, out of Brandon and uh, is really coming on, brings a lot of size to that position. So, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're just – and then uh, Ethan Bumgardner is a young man, you know, that, that was here with us last year and redshirted. So we got six guys working right there. You know, I think, uh, like I said, Kyron and Bryson are starting. Uh, but, man, Gabe is really talented. Middleton's got some ability, and, and Peyton McKinnon's coming on as well to, to really push him. Speaking to some guys that um, – young guys that need to take the next step. This is a big spring for them, guys like – Kenyon Clay, um, J. Rob, Zay, Franks. Uh, you kind of hit on those guys a little bit. Like, what's the next step for, for those guys? Yeah, you know, we just we signed those guys to be good players, and they're our kids, right? Those are Southern Miss kids, Mississippi kids. We named some more. Davis Dalton's a young man that's coming along. Um, you know, on defense, you said J. Rob, Cam Knox, Jordan Martin at the star position. Um, you know, man, all those guys, Ely Fuvi, those are young guys that they've redshirted now, so now it's time to play. And you have to earn playing time, you know, by, by, by consistently doing the right things. And I think they are. They're great kids, and I think they're going to be really good football players, you know, for a long time. Some more, uh, Claiborne Pollard on the offensive line, Will Saxton at guard, young guy that redshirted. He's got a lot of ability and a lot of want to. Uh, you know, so, so uh, Evan McNally's a young kid at tight end that's showing some things. Uh, so we, we got a lot of young kids in our program that, that, we're, that we think are going to bring a lot of value this year. Before you've watched the film, just your thoughts on quarterback play today? I thought they did some good things. You know, I saw, uh, you know, Billy made some great throws. Billy's really good at setting the protections and getting us in the right play already. He's highly cerebral. Uh, you know, Holman flashes with his arm talent and his running ability. Uh, I saw old Wilkie rip a seam in there one time. It was just awesome. And uh, so good competition in there. Uh, and it's, it's, it's been really fun coaching them. And uh, they're really taking ownership of it and doing some good things.